artists' highest charting bop versus their lowest charting flop. Up next is global superstar Dua Lipa. So although Dua Lipa has not had any songs reach number one on the Billboard Hot 100, she has had two songs come close, one of them being her best charting single. Come on, dance with me. Levitating became Dua's second song to peak at number 2 after Don't Start Now, but by the way it performed you would think it was a number 1. It spent 41 weeks in the top 10 and has been charting for over a year. Not only did Levitating become Dua's highest charting bop, but Billboard also named it the best charting song of 2021. Now the time has come to talk about Dua's lowest charting flop. Also this is a series so follow me and request any artist you want to see next. So luckily for Dua, she got her lowest charting single pretty early on in her career. Scared to be Lonely with Martin Garrix was a huge hit in European countries, but of course, the US was tasteless and let it flop. It peaked at number 76, but this was also before Dua became famous in the US, so it makes sense why it underperformed in the country. 